Welcome back to the channel guys, Crypto Lightsaber back again with another video and today I want to talk about Uniswap's Uni token and show you what I'm seeing in this chart at the moment. Okay, but before we start, I'd just like to say um, a couple of times I've actually found uh, new YouTube channels uh, with not many views but stealing my content and uploading my videos as their own. Okay, it was first pointed out to me by a subscriber. That somebody had uploaded one of my videos as their own and was stealing my content okay so what I've had to do for that one is I had to then open a copyright complaint with YouTube and get the video removed okay and um, shortly after that I found another channel that had also done the same thing stolen one of my videos and uploaded it as their own okay I also had to do a copyright complaint get that removed okay because it's one thing, you know, getting one of my videos and kind of pulling it up on your video and talking about something that I said and, you know, accrediting that to me, but um, just taking the whole video and the thumbnail, uploading it as your own video, um, that's just, you know, it's a bit out, out of order and it takes away from my own channel, doesn't it? So, um, yeah, guys, if you do see anything like that, please let me know. All right, guys, so now let's get into the chart. Um, you can see I like to use the old website on Binance, okay? I've, I've just because historically I've always used the old website, I will use the old website until I can no longer use it and then I'll have to start using the new one, all right? But um, right now it's moving a bit different, it's looking a bit dodgy, it doesn't normally look like this, um, so it's throwing me off a little bit with all the white and stuff like that, the inconsistency with the color. But I'm just going to go ahead and show you what I'm looking at in this chart okay so as you can see the price is currently at four dollars and 19 cents all right um and it is trending up at the moment or well it's, it's been trending down but i'm starting to see a break in the trend okay we're starting to see something different as you can see you got this candle over here turtlenecking popping itself out of the line okay obviously you can see what what i've got there is i've got a descending triangle drawn there okay which is generally a bullish pattern okay um it's highly probable for a break to the upside right now we're on a four hour chart we need to see a four hour candle body close okay so we need to see this candle just remain out there all right guys and then i would think that okay we're beginning to trend up all right putting a higher high and a higher low and then we're, we're off to go um if we go down the time frames okay if we go into two hour you'll see we've already got the candle body close all right and if we go to the one hour which i use more frequently um just to check that out you can see we do have the candle body close and the candles are trending upwards at the moment now we saw it come down from about just eight dollars and 68 cents almost nine dollars okay and it's been a long winded you know correction to the downside okay but um you know if this pattern is correct then we see a beautiful breakout coming at the moment we also see on the rsi we see we've got a double bottom on the rsi okay and now it's starting to trend upwards it's taken out this level over here on the rsi if we put a line there you can see the rsi is popping out over that line now at the moment also we have a bullish macd cross on the one hour and it's doing that nice w pattern hopefully you can get a momentum well we've got a momentum shift to the upside but we can hopefully we can see something like that with a big push all right guys if we go back on the four hour you won't be able to see much from the macd but what you can see is you can see the rsi come all the way down and hit a little bit of a bottom over there that's my line which will just remove it as you can see it's curling over now to the upside and hopefully you see um that formation continue to the upside like that now we have to look on those time frames because on the one hour you can't really tell more, much of a story all right but we've seen this lots of times on uniswap charts okay you see it come up all right then you get that big correction then you see some massive impulse to the upside i'm not saying that's going to happen with uni okay i'm just looking at what i see happening at the moment right now so i believe that we could get a push to the upside on that okay another thing in my telegram group I actually pointed out that I thought way up here 
that we were going down to about four dollars okay my line of support was actually over here at about three dollars and 85 cents okay in fact i was looking on a lower time frame so i'll just get that accurate for you okay we'll draw that out um my support line if i go over here was over here okay and i expected to get some sort of a bounce up there all right um, as you can see it came down a little bit lower than that i adjusted my line down here all right guys we can see we've got a perfect bounce okay it did dip down uh, very slightly okay i thought it would be about three dollars and eighty cents it just went down and wicked down to about three dollars and seventy five cents before we got it um um we, we held support up there and now we're breaking out all right so that was a uh, that was a great call all right um also um if we draw our fibonacci retracement if we go from the very bottom here what you'll see is this lines up perfectly with the 0.786 level okay which is normally a good area for a bounce after a full correction you can see that lines up completely perfectly on the purple line crossing through into this 0.786 level all right guys so that's what i've been looking at with this and why i'm confident now all right um to put a buy on which i've already done by the way and kind of hold that and see if we can get an impulse to the upside okay so that's what i'm expecting with this all right guys now it may not play out that way at the end of the day um i'm going with probability okay i can't tell the future i don't make price predictions you know that already on this channel guys let's just get rid of that uh let's just get rid of the that okay um so yeah i mean what i'm expecting now is a move to the upside okay i don't think it's going to happen quickly all right i think it could take its time but we'd like to see it start uh, begin to start uptrending back to the upside now okay whether it comes up to this level and kind of gets a double top and gets rejected that is a, poten a potential scenario okay whether it begins to go sideways in this level or we get a breakout uh, you know if we do get a breakout above that level then my target previously was around 10 to 12 dollars all right and i wouldn't be surprised if that did happen okay as per elliott wave theory if we did look at it like that you know what you'd say is um you know there could be uh, more of an impulsive wave if we go from there you say that was a wave one then you get the two and then it could come up and out the free wave is normally the biggest wave um so it could, prob could probably push past 12 dollars with a blow off top let's say um, 13 14 dollars and this is not you know this this is just a potential scenario okay and then back down roughly around here and then go up for like a wave five all right now i'm not an expert on elliott waves by any means okay but the wave five is normally short so put that about there uh, so that could be a potential scenario okay guys but um yeah don't quote me on this this is just um speculation you know all right so um yeah that's just what i'm looking at for the uni chart now i would hope that it would begin to go upwards now okay but we'll have to wait and see how that plays out am i right or am i wrong okay at least for the short term i believe that we're going to get a move to the upside okay and we'll have to see whether i'm right on that all right so if you're following the channel guys make sure you subscribe make sure you tick the little bell to get the notifications as i post a video also um like leave a comment down below if you're not following me on twitter my Twitter um, ID is on the screen down here somewhere. Okay, it's at Crypto Lightsaber, spell L-Y-T-S-A-B-E-R for lightsaber, not L-I-G-H-T. All right, guys, get over and follow me on Twitter. All right, that is normally the first place that I alert the video. So if you are on Twitter and you've got your notifications turned on, you'll actually see it there first. All right, guys, so yeah, that's it for now, and I'll see you guys in the next video would like to support the channel there's actually a way you can do that now while getting something out of it for yourself we have a new clothing brand called parabolic this is a brand dedicated to the crypto space i use the name parabolic because that's the kind of movement we like to see in those charts now there's a range of products you can choose from from hoodies vests socks even face masks during this pandemic time and we're using the lightsaber to represent the youtube channel okay there'll be a link in the description so you can go and check that out got a range of different colors range of different products all right and what i'll actually be doing is for the first 100 people that do actually buy something if you send me a message what i'll do is i'll send you a free invite 
for the new telegram group which will be a paid telegram group okay after that okay so the first 100 people you will get a invite sent to you for free all right even if you buy something as small as a mug you will get that just to show my appreciation for your support as well okay guys so you've got a chance to be the exclusive members of the new group you've also got a chance to get your hands on some exclusive merchandise so link in the description get on over to the website and make your purchase now remember the trend is your friend